Rwanda today has transformed from the dark days of genocide 20 years ago. Those who live through this chapter of Rwanda's history see the anniversary of the genocide with different eyes. I am chosen. I'm chosen. Why I'm saying I'm chosen, I have passed it to, to, to difficult situation, terrible. And I, in Rwanda, as my nation, um, one million people died on that period of genocide. Who am I to, to remain? Because I was not one who knew to hate more than others. Sometime I have met with the killers. It's, it's 20 years ago of those things happening in our nation, but I remember one day when I was in 1998, they came and they killed the, 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 the people on that refuge. The blood, I will see it, and the people, they are cutting the neck and and the, the legs are so terrible things on that night. They're starting to shoot people and they're using pang and something terrible like that. But on that day, I fell down and the blood came on my clothes and they covered me. So just, I think the killers, they think, ah, he died. He, no, one, no one who came to me and he told me. So I think, really, I believe I'm chosen. Other, other people, they died because of hungry, they cut off fast. M many people, they are so traumatized, especially my generation, many of them, they, they, are, still, they are still surviving with uh, one of them, they are handicapped, they don't have rigs, they don't have eyes, they are have HVs because of rape. Even the, the women, they rape small boys like, uh, like me. But me, I am. I don't have HIV. I'm free. But I think this is the grace of God.